After 17 years, two of the most recognizable X-Men in the movie world, Hugh Jackman's Wolverine and Patrick Stewart's Professor Charles Xavier, have given their final bows as their beloved characters. Logan may be the most dystopian X film, but it also represents a new beginning, introducing a brand new character, Laura Kinney, played by Daphne Keane. But what do we know about this fresh mutant hero and the young actress who portrays her? Who is Laura Kinney? Very simply put, Laura is a clone of Wolverine made by the Transigen Corporation, engineered to do everything her genetic popper can do, which is legitimately terrifying. No. 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 She shares Logan's superior strength, agility, and mutant healing abilities. She's also been given dual adamantium claws on each hand and has the added bonus of a deadly claw on each foot. In every sense but gender, she's Wolverine Jr. and her on-screen story closely mirrors her comic book origins. Writer Craig Kyle first created X-23 during the four-year run of the Warner Brothers animated series X-Men Evolution. Laura Kinney rapidly cut a swath of popularity through the superhero world, getting reverse adapted back into Marvel Comics and landing two miniseries and an ongoing solo series. Like Wolverine, X-23 was one of the X-Men's most successful upstarts and also, like Wolverine, she's done time on several superhero squads including the hyper-violent X-Force and all-new X-Men and the Avengers Academy comic series. Eventually, Laura was officially dubbed as the all-new Wolverine when the Marvel Universe rebooted in 2016. A title she's carried since as of the making of this video, so it wouldn't be unrealistic to expect the movies to follow suit. Who is Daphne Keane? Born in 2005, Daphne Keane Fernandez is the child of a British father and a Spanish mother. As a result, she's bilingual, one of the requirements for the role since James Mangold envisioned a Hispanic X-23. She's also well-versed in gymnastics and martial arts, which were obviously also important for the role of a girl who literally kills dozens of people with her floor routine. Her mother is Spanish actress and playwright Maria Fernandez Arche, and her father is actor Will Keane, both of whom have acted extensively for theatre, film and television in Spain and the UK. Most recently, Mr. Keane landed a prominent recurring role as Michael Adeen in the Netflix biographical drama The Crown. Will Keane has also appeared on the longtime 1940s era mystery series Foil's War and the TV series The Refugees in which he co-starred with his daughter. How'd she get the role? In Logan, Daphne Keane's characterizations and feral intensity were leaps and bounds beyond most child actors, immediately catching the attention of director James Mangold. According to Mangold, her audition tape included moments where the young actress clambered up bookshelves, prowling and tumbling around her parents' house. After watching her run through a few scenes, the director was mesmerized enough by her performance to immediately request a screen test, and he admitted, the biggest question to me was, will you believe this little girl is capable of doing what the comics have proposed she can do. I think in many ways that's Daphne's amazing achievement, holding it all together. In a role as physically and emotionally demanding as X-23, Keane was more than capable of bringing the rage-filled mutant to life, even without speaking for most of the movie. Unbelievably, this was only her second time on screen. Will X-23 return? Hugh Jackman decided to step away from his 17-year run as the metal-boned mutant, so a similarly named sequel is extremely unlikely, despite the amazing success of Logan. But that doesn't mean X-23 won't reappear. Recently, Keane and director James Mangold were both asked about their interest in the continuing saga of Laura Kinney. Mangold says he's wide open to the concept of more X-23, and the young starlet likewise sounds interested in pursuing the role as well. Keane explained, her relationship with the character, telling The Hollywood Reporter, she's complicated, she tries to be so strong but she feels so vulnerable at the same time, I really love her, I'd love to keep playing her. Of course, who wouldn't love to have a starring role in a comic book movie franchise, especially at the age of 12? Fox's X-Men producer slash writer Simon Kinberg already admitted an X-23 solo movie is a very real possibility, but at this time, the studio hasn't finalized any plans for a follow-up. The explosive success of the final Wolverine outing will undoubtedly light up all sorts of new possibilities for the future of the franchise, and there's no way they're leaving the all-new Wolverine out of action. 
Thanks for watching. Click the looper icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.